Right, folks. Um, just got to do a just a shout out. Who was that one that uh, Georgie One Foot? Uh, George Onefoot. George Onefoot. Um, he lives in Chepshire. Apparently had an accident at work. So hello to you. And the other one is to. It's, this is a late one. I forget to do them. This is why I've stopped doing them because I do actually forget, and then people might get offended. But I don't mean to forget. But I just forget, and that's it. Uh, but I'll do this one. It's a uh, happy ninth birthday. Uh, it, to Matilda Summers. Uh, I do apologise, it's a late birthday, happy birthday thing, but uh, happy birthday, Matilda Summers. Right, this is a haul, and uh, June watches people, and they do a Primark haul. They do a Asda haul, and they do whatever kind of fucking haul they do. They do a haul. Fuck all. They do fuck all. That is correct, June. Um, so what I'm going to do, folks, I'm going to do a Poundland haul, because... Why not? Why not, says June. Uh, why not? Because, um, I've been getting, not carried away, but I've, I've been starting doing things a little bit more expensive, and I've seemed to have lost my way a little bit on trying to do stuff for, for the, the, the lower end of the price, uh, rack bracket. So I have been to Poundland today. Uh, I didn't need my passport. I was okay to get into Poundland. What's up? Nothing. Are you watching that bloody dog? I am watching that. Yeah, watch that bloody dog. So what I've done, folks, I've been and got a few things. Um, I've got the price list there, the receipt. So June can tell me the price of the items that I have bought from Poundland. So what I'm going to do, folks, uh, we're going to start with these um, liqueurs. And uh, I have got some... Gin Lick Yours Chocolate. Um, there they are. For the visually impaired, I'm holding them up. Right, for the visually impaired, I'm stabbing the box, getting rid of that cellophane thing. Cellophane thing, and... I could do with that knife sharpening tube. Right, um, oh, well, oh, look at that, one's been squashed, it's been, <laughs> it's been killed to the paper, looks like a bug, uh, so that's probably why, how much were these June, do you want to have a check at the price list? A pound! Gin, oh, that was good, so these gin liqueurs from Poundland cost a pound, um, oh they're all over the place, oh they're all, they're all soft, yeah, Tastes good, like this. Yeah, tastes good, like Mmm. It's your typical dark chocolate. Mmm. But you're full, you've had them next to the kettle. I've had them next to the oven. Yeah, that's why they've got I've had them next to the oven, we've just had um, hosting duck wraps and chips. Well, tell people what they're like then. Nice dark chocolate. With gin in it. Mm, I don't know if it tastes of gin especially, but it's alcohol. Yeah, I don't think it's... Um... That's enough. You... Don't you have a one? I had the squashed one. Right. So we'll keep up with the liqueurs. Um, I've gone for the uh, process Prosecco liqueurs now. Um, You've got chocolate all over that. That doesn't matter. Don't do that at home, folks. As the rest is saying, don't try this at home. Don't stick a knife in your... So. It's the same uh, box kind of thing again, only this one says Prosecco and uh, not Jim. Uh, how much were these uh, liqueurs chocolates, June? Um... They were a pound. So once again, you see, um, there, there is a uh, there's a bit of a, a theme going on here at Poundland that uh, most items might cost a pound. Is this dark chocolate? This one. This one. Oh, it is. Yeah. Didn't look as dark as the other one. Mmm. Mmm. 
Now that does taste. Yeah. Yeah, I was expecting um, it to taste the same as the gin was because that to me, the gin just tasted of a generic alcohol, could yeah. have been anything. But they do actually mm. taste of Prosecco. In fact, I know a girl, I mentioned her in the um, book fast video, Leona. And I think she quite likes the Prosecco or five. Um, Leona, get yourself down Poundland. Mind you, no, no, you should probably have proper Prosecco. One more, one more. They're lovely. They're really lovely. You're supposed to be on a diet. Come on. Mm. I've got my punch ball trap. You better get punching your ball then, aren't you? What's next? Well, I've no ball punching. Right. Um, here we go now. We have got um, popping candy. But it's popping passion candy. So in theory, what I'm actually hoping to do is to uh, pop one of these into June's mouth and the video will end there and we'll pop off and have some passion. <laughs> right. Um, how much are these, June? Um, let me check the receipt. They're a pound. We've got a ripping bit. Sorry, sweetheart. We've got the scissors. So, there's 20 sachets of... Uh, Condoms. Hey, are they? Everybody has to work. Yeah, it's not being Well, where did you get popping candy condoms? No, that would be good, wouldn't it? Well, I don't know, because yours all end up on the wall anyway. What, the condoms? Yeah. Yeah, you take them off and just fling them, don't you, and they stick to the wall. No, you, you had them all day. Yeah. Well, come on, fault, is it? They were fucking it, it was inside out. You tried to roll it on inside out. Yeah, that's when we first started going out. No, it weren't. Weren't it? We were married. Oh, yeah, because you want to. Uh... That. Can <coughs> 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 you remember this? Spa <coughs> <coughs> Space dust. Be careful what you do with it. It's hit her at the back of the throat. <laughs> yeah, the space dust, when it very first came out in the open, Yeah, it's big chunks of this, isn't it? It's Let like me... that, because a lot of the um, popping candy you get now is rubbish. Yeah, it is. No doubt it's been bloody... Yeah, that's a better one for me. Um, for the visually impaired... Oh, shit. There is the popping candy dust. Hey, you could put this in a cup of tea somewhere. What for? I don't know. Excuse me. I'm going to want to see down your kitchen. Give some to the dog. No. Just go and wash my hands, folks. Why not? You're sending mad. What do you mean, sending mad? He is mad. Right. So, uh, did we score how much that was, June? Yes, it was a pound. It was it a pound. Received. Right. Right. Oh, it's popping in my ear holes, I can... <coughs> yeah, very good popping candy, that. Got a t-shirt, folks. Eat, drink and be pissed. Right, so what we got left? Um, we're now moving on to the... I don't know if you've ever heard of a film called Frozen. Have you ever... I've heard of it. I've never seen it. Um, this is it. Uh, wait, this isn't the it. This isn't the film of it, but this is a uh, spin-off of... Frozen. Apparently there is a Frozen 2. Too cold. Uh, it's a Christmas selection box and um, it's by Kinterton. Kinnerton. Kin Kinnerton. 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 And um, they've obviously jumped onto the uh, bandwagon of Frozen. A bit like I'm doing with this because no doubt I'll write it up in the tags and um, <laughs> might get caught on. Oh, well, it's not Up here for thinking, you know, folks, down here for dancing, well, down here for shagging, then further down for dancing. No, it ain't, because you don't move your feet. What, when I'm shagging? No. Oh, right. <laughs> dancing. Oh, right. I don't know. I don't, no, I don't move your feet. feet. I don't move, eh? I've never seen your feet. I've had the lollipop. We've been married over 20, we're 20 years. No, on. look. So, what you have, don't oh, just chomping it in yet, sweetheart. I have to view it. Oh. Um, you get a lollipop with... Uh, 
Uh, I don't know her name. Blombird. Blombird. Um, is it Elsa? Don't know. Elsa. Ginger. Ginger! We're just going to the research team for the uh, names of Frozen. Stairs are creaking, June's going up them. It's either, her, it's either the stairs or her knees. Elsa. Elsa. So it's Elsa. Elsa on the front. Um, you got so you got a chocolate lollipop, you got a chocolate bar. You got a chocolate buttons and then you have got chocolate bits. Chocolate nipple things here uh, with a snowman on. I wonder what his name is. Don't have that, you can finish this one. Yeah, so that's it really folks, this is it. Uh, and uh, how much was the um, chocolate uh, from Poundland? Um, frozen, frozen two that is at the bottom. So, a pound. Pound, it was a pound. So, quite a nice chocolate that. Mm. I think there's the. Uh, I was expecting that to be really cheap, nasty. Mm. I think that Kinderton is quite a good chocolate. Right, folks. Um, Tastes a bit like Galaxy. Here we have instant snow blizzard in a can. Go on then. Um, warning not suitable for children under the age of 36. Well, who the bloody hell is going to give a kid a can of snow? I open the can, add a small amount of water. Right. I'll get the water. June's going to get the water. So there it is, look, folks. There's the instructions on the side How of the. How much water uh, do you need? Do you need uh, to put it in the can or? Add a small amount of water into the can and watch the snow grow. Do that was Pyrex, Joe. Right, so it's a pull open lid, not a uh, thingy lid. Uh, it's in a. But it says pour it in the can, but that's a bit misleading. Well, it is, I suppose, you know, in this day and age, somebody could do that. Pour the can in, uh, pour the water into the can while it's still in its, uh, that looks like some kind of drug. That looks like it's been smuggled up somebody's ass. Not that I know anything about it. So, we'll, uh, why does that do that? Stick to you. Static. Static. That's like half the workforce where I work. Fucking static. So, uh, just put a little bit in, June. Not a lot. Just a drip. Whoa! <coughs> Blow it. Now stir it with a little. Give it a bit spoon. of a stir. Is it growing? Need a bit more. I think it needs a bit more, June. Give it another stir. And it said it's it grows. Not seeing much growing happening. Not much growing there, it looks like fucking slush. Chuck some more water in June. June's mixing a batter pudding. No, it's not much of a blizzard. Chuck that in then. I mean, when it says amount of water, what amount of water does it need? It needs a bit more, I mean, well, they didn't even tell you to take it out of the packet. Well, they didn't even tell you to take it out of the packet. Have you ever seen that one where that person had a um, a vehicle, a mobile home in America, and uh, it had auto cruise or auto, what is it? Uh, when you just, cruise control. Cruise control. And uh, what they did, they set the cruise control off and fucked off in the back and made a cup of coffee. And... Um, and then they crashed and what they did they actually took the company to court and they won because they said that you do not leave the vehicle unattended while driving um put a bit more snow in that water lover i mean water. should we pour it in there so we can see what's happening yeah that's a bloody good idea you ain't just a wazzo pair of jugs here lover no no well i don't know i don't know more water's gonna do anything no i don't June is now turning the tap and she's put a bit more water into the jug and she's giving it a good mix. It's not getting any bigger. It's not getting any bigger. That's it, that's your blizzard. Right, that's... You get uh, well, it... about a quarter of a pint of blizzard. There it is, folks. Don't bother. Don't bother with that one. 
Yeah. Right, I tell you what, June. Kids we'll, might like. We'll put a bit, bit more water in it. You know, uh, let's see if we can um, get this thing to move. That's it. It's just not getting any bigger. It's just not getting any bigger. We've heard that before. Oh, she's drowned it. No, oh no, it's just no. That that was a mistake. No, June's killed it. June's washed the snow away. So here we are, folks. We've um, we've put we've, that Ooh. is. That's it. Don't bother with the snow. Fuck off. <laughs> right. It um. It, it feels a bit siliconish. Yeah. A bit rubberish. Um, yeah, I, um... Don't bother with that. Well, uh, you know, I mean... How much was that, June? Um, a pound. Right, that was a pound. No, so we've got two left to go, folks. Uh, I also bought some sellotape. How much was the sellotape? A pound. A pound. Um, I have got an abominable stretchy ball, bola para apreta. Oh, that's uh, in Spanish. Um... <laughs> Rubata, stretch and squeeze. Rubata, he said. Um, it's a stretchy ball. Basically, it's just a stretchy ball. Um, I have no idea. Can you find out how much the stretchy ball was, please? June. Uh, a pound. Hey, pound. Now what are you doing, June? <laughs> right. Uh, so, let's uh, open up the uh, abominable snowball. Um. What? Ginger, it's passion candy. Don't go taking that, you'll be torn it. Careful, because it's quite... Don't care. So, this is what it is then, folks. It's a... a it's a... I fucking can't get it. There we go. Now... Ooh. Now I. Oh, there's snow in there. I imagine I. Cut it open. As you can <laughs> see, for, well, not if you're visually impaired, you can't see. But inside this um, stretchy thing is quite good, isn't it? I. Now, obviously, I wouldn't do that to a uh, whatever I'm going to say it is. But I imagine that's how a breast. Of uh, implant. implant would feel. So, folks, uh, <laughs> um, yeah, if you want to, I don't know. Is, can, is it for stress relief or what? I don't know, I think it's just for arsing about with. Let me no. feel it. Ginge wants to feel it. Ooh. I quite like that for uh, how much was it? Oh, it's my point, Shane. Well, we'll put it in a bra and you can pretend it's a real thing. You to me are everything, the sweetest thing I, I can sing, old baby. Cut it open. Not it. cutting it open. <laughs> Do you know what? I quite like that. <laughs> it makes my hands feel weird. Why is it dry? I'm not sure what the point is. Can we stretch it? How far well, you can we stretch, stretch it? it? Let's see how far we can stretch so, it. Yeah, don't break it though. Because I like that. Well, you got to do it on camera, June. You can't just... Yeah. I'll have to take that round to, uh, what? Let me feel it again. I'll have to take that round to Uncle Steve and Auntie Sue. Oh, it's coming on. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, so I quite like that. Right, uh, this is the last one then, folks, uh, in my uh, shit happens bag. How much was the bag, June, from uh, Poundland? A pound. A pound. So, here we have uh, Disney uh, jumping on the old, uh, who's that, Ginge? What? Who's the brown, who's the ginger one? Uh, Anna? I don't know. Anna? Um, so what it is, folks, this is a fizzy apple splash, and uh, it's, um, it's not alcoholic, it's just fizzy apple splash. And um, I've just jumped on the old Frozen bandwagon again, but because of Frozen, and let's face it, Frozen is a pretty popular film. <laughs> <coughs> and some people are struggling for money. I say a lot of people are struggling for money. <coughs> Open that door, June. I'm gasping here. 
Uh, people are struggling for money and anything that with Frozen on it will help them out and keep their youngsters happy. Um, so it's just uh, Fizzy Apple Splash. June, can you please tell me the price of the Fizzy Apple Splash from Poundland? Two pounds. Two, two pound? You've been robbed. Are they taking the piss? You've been robbed. They're taking the piss. Why is it two pounds? Because I don't know. Because it is. I can't open the damn thing. The thing is here, look. No. It's in tape, but you've got to pull that down. Oh, I would have done. So, there's an apple. Let's give it a bit of a... Ooh, thought I would have fizz up then. Let's um put one of them pack popping candies in it. Oh yeah, that'd be a good idea, wouldn't it? Well, let me just try it as it is first. She's swinging it out of the bottle like she should. Oh, that's quite nice. That is quite good, isn't it? Mm, I, don't, I don't like apple juice, do no. I? That's quite nice. Like fruity apple taste. <laughs> Ginger's Mr. Uh, Ginger's Mr. God. <laughs> It is, that's quite good, isn't it? Kids would like that on the Christmas table in a wine glass. They'd think they would be yeah, they would. They'd think they were being all grown up drinking um, Prosecco. Yeah. It's a nice bottle as well, though. It is, it's a nice bottle. It's a well thought out thing. Uh, Disney are good at this kind of shit, isn't they? They know how to, you know, basically take money off us. Yeah, they know how to uh, thing it. So it's Disney Kitchen. So there you have it, folks. That is our uh, shopping haul from Poundland. And um, I think it cost me a tenner in all. So um, there you go. Get yourself down Poundland and... Um, knock yourself out. Knock yourself out. Laters.